that that's a piebald doe and a piebald male uh, 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 buck in the same little herd here oh my goodness it's amazing I just I mean, I'm out here trying to find all my my fallow deer spots on Te Aoroa so that I can do my like my fallow deer great one grind on this map going along the coast here um you know wasn't much here but right on top of me essentially wow and she just moved out into the open there that is incredible I hope there's nothing else in like render that I'm gonna spook but look at that and they're different patterns too that's awesome let's um I messed that shot up I thought I oh that's not good well she's floating away and the buck apparently I messed my shot up on well, he'll go down no matter what and it wasn't that big so I'm not that you know upset about it if it if it was messed up I could I don't know how uh, unless he, he, he moved right when I shot, or if I was just aiming too far back, which is possible. I, I do tend to do that on accident. I don't know. That's weird, but at least we'll get our, our doe before she floats away here. Yeah, look at that. Female piebald. I think it's my first female uh, piebald uh, fallow deer. Taxidermy is that before I forget. Very nice. Yeah, that's definitely a piebald pattern I haven't seen. I don't know if it's just different because it's a female or or what, but still very cool. I've got to go find... Yep, he is down now. And we can find the blood. Yeah, definitely was a no organs hit, so I don't know I don't know where I hit on that, but um, definitely messed it up. Although I don't think it was going to be big enough to really be a gold or anything which that would that would have been unfortunate it'll probably be bronze now that i've messed it up but that's all right let's go track him down now and here is our guy right up here he got quite a distance away i am definitely upset that we messed that shot up but thankfully it was on a pie ball and not on something that i haven't gotten before so yeah and that i clip his ear i think i just clipped his ear it looks like yeah, that 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 looks like it. <laughs> so, so we're gonna tax him is that because it is something we don't see every day. Would have just been a silver though. Didn't make gold. But yeah, he just started to do the flea animation. It took too long in between the shot, and uh, yeah, that's definitely unfortunate. But I mean, it's all, it's all right. Like I said, just a pie ball. I've got two of them in the lodge, and now that's my fourth pie ball, counting the the dough. But still, the main takeaway from that is that's, you know, the piebald pair out of one herd, which is incredible. Um, I've shot, I mean, a bunch of fallow here today, even more up here. And those are definitely the first, uh, you know, rares we've seen. So that's incredible. And I hope it's just a sign of, of more to come. All right. And here we are back in the lodge after that fallow deer hunt. That was pretty incredible i've never had that happen before I, I i know pie balls aren't the rarest of rares in fact they're more of the more on the uncommon side of rares for most species but it's still really cool to see that two spawn in one herd i've i've definitely seen it with with ducks like mallards a lot because pie balls for mallards are a pretty common sight um but never for fallow deer or any other kind of animal i guess for that matter so just in this main area of our lodge, since I've got some head plaques available, I put our yeah, our buck there. This is 163 scoring, but only is a bronze because we messed up the shot. And then we've got our female there, kind of on opposite sides of our gray Iberian mouflon here. Really, really cool. Melanistic mallard there with our dusky uh, hoodoo up there. But really, just such so incredible. Like, I saw the the... 
the top of the the dough as she was moving like towards the water there and pretty much as i registered that she was a piebald i saw the buck standing to the side as well and i kind of just that 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 was just such a cool experience so yeah absolutely beautiful i like that i'm getting all these lodge spots filled up as well we're running out of full body plaques so we're gonna have to start moving a lot more animals to these uh, shoulder mounts uh, which means I'm probably going to be moving a lot more of my diamonds off of the um, the full body plaques and up onto, you know, the shoulder mounts so that we can make room for more rares on the full body so we can actually see what their, you know, fur types look like, kind of like our bison here. But yeah, that's going to do today's video. So thank you so much for watching, especially if you made it this far. I really, really do appreciate it. It means a lot to me. Uh, but you're now leaving the danger zone, so stay safe out there, and I hope to catch you back here next time. Goodbye.